you guys might be able to see right there. But there is one other thing that I want to do. That's uh, something to secure cargo in the back. Well, good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Hey, today we're going to do another little mod for the uh, Gladiator back here. You know, a couple days ago, I put the bed mat in it. You guys might be able to see right there. But there is one other thing that I want to do, and that is to put something in to secure... That's a little bit of a close-up there, isn't it? That's uh, something to secure cargo in the back. So we actually tried this on Mom's Gladiator, and it works pretty well, I think. Of course, in the truck, it has these little slots. Let me point you down. These little slots in the sides here, right? It's one over here, one corresponding uh, same position on the other side. And I'm going to have a tonneau cover on it. So I'm going to put just a 2x4 across there in those slots. Um, not just a 2x4, it's going to be personalized to match the truck. But I'm going to put a 2x4 across there so that once the tonneau cover is on and I shut the back, whatever I have in there won't roll up to the front, right? It'll stop at that piece of wood. And then I have to try to either crawl up to the front to get, you know, that potato that might roll up there or whatever it is. It'll stop at the board. So I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. It's not very complicated. Um, and it'll save you a lot of grief if you haul anything in the back and you happen to have a tonneau cover. Okay, we got it all set up. I've got the uh, piece here from my mother's truck, actually. And I am going to just go ahead and use it as a guide because it fits a little bit loose. We didn't want it so tight that it scrapes in there you know so i'm going to go ahead and just mark it off i've got the circular saw here to cut it and i will measure it for you guys let you know what the uh, length of it is so if you want to do it obviously you won't have my mom's there all right so let's go ahead and, uh, and mark it again i wouldn't do it this way except it's not an exact science so not a big deal let me grab a tape measure and i'll tell you exactly how long it is Okay, here we go. It is 57 and a half inches. This black piece, which fits in my mother's, is 57 and a half inches long. So if you're looking to do this, all you need is a board that's 57 and a half inches long. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this, and then uh, and then I am going to paint it. I'll show you that in a couple minutes. So let me get the saw set up, and then we'll get this thing cut. Okay, I have my helper with me here. This is this is mom, by the way. She's gonna hold the board while I uh, cut it there. So, here we go. See if it fits. Let me flip you guys around here. See if it fits in the slots in the truck there. I hope so. It's a hair loose, to be honest, but that's okay. It doesn't bother me. It fits in there so it'll be easy to get in and out and won't rub all over the place. Okay, we got it done. We've got it cut. Now I have to paint it. Uh, I thought about going with just black, but I'm actually trying to match the truck, so I got some Color Max. Krylon paint. It's actually uh, satin pebble. So it, it really does match uh, the truck pretty well. I'll show you real quick. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it's a, it's a pretty good match to the truck. So it should look pretty good, I think. So I'm going to go ahead and paint that. I'm not going to show that. I assume everybody out there knows how to paint. So once this is all done and we wrap it up, I'll show you what it looks like inside the truck. Okay, continuing on with the Jeep mod. This is the board mod right here to keep stuff from rolling around. We've got mom over here working on hers. You can see there. And we're going to put some felt around the ends here just to kind of keep it from sliding in and out in that groove. We don't want it to scratch up the paint. I know it's a truck, but hey, why not protect it a little bit while you're at it? So we're going to wrap some felt around here. She's marking hers off right now. 
and we're going to see how this goes so I'll update you as we go. If you want to you can measure yours. Okay, mine is done. She's making hers a little prettier. But uh, next up, we're gonna go try it in the Jeep. We'll probably actually try hers in hers out in the garage there and see if it worked. Okay, here we go. We're gonna see if it fits. I can't do that. Want me to put it in? I can hold this. Okay, we have a new filmer. Here we go. The carrot wants to put it this way. Put it the pretty way. tighter fit but it fits what do you think again it was to the whole idea is just to protect the paint over there from the edge of the wood you know sliding in and out of the groove it is uh, it is a pretty good fit actually you guys can see right there so I think it's pretty good it'll probably actually loosen up or maybe the wood will swell a little I don't know but uh, I think it's a pretty good setup Okay, we've got mine done here, so we're going to try this out real quick, too, just to make sure it fits in here. I'm not going to keep it in until, uh, until I get the tonneau cover, but for now, I'll give it a try. And see, it's actually pretty snug. Came out snugger than I thought it was going to. Wow. It does fit, so that's a good thing. There you go, and then push the side all the way down. Huh? And there you go. So, like I said, it is uh, it is a bit snugger, snugger is that a word? Snugger uh, than I thought it was going to be, but that's okay. It is probably never going to be out of there because if I really need to haul anything, I'll take the Tacoma up there. So that's it. That's how it's going to fit. The whole purpose of this, of course, is to be able to store stuff here, put stuff in to haul it. And uh, with the tonneau cover over the top, I don't want stuff rolling up to the front because then how do you get it? Crawl underneath the tonneau cover or have to undo the tonneau cover? This will be much simpler. You guys can see right there, we have a nice little space where we can put stuff and, uh, and it won't roll up there in the front. So pretty cool. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> oh wow all of a sudden she's camera shy anyway that uh, that's my little bed board mod we'll call it in the jeep gladiator leave a comment let me know what you think thanks for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe and we'll see you next time on the web have a great day bye